Hi, in this video we will learn how to multiply matrices. So here we have two uh, column vectors. We uh, remember that the dot product of x and y, x dot y, or the scalar product is uh, so here x1 times y1 plus x2 times y2 plus x3 times y3. So the multiplication of two matrices is with this idea. So here uh, x transpose so the transpose of colon is row so row times colon is the dot product of x and y so here the product is x1 y1 plus x2 y2 plus x3 y y3 so this is the key idea of the multiplication of two matrices now if we have two matrices a and b a is m by n matrix and b is n by p matrix so here this matrix is with n color and this matrix is with n rows so the product of a and b is a matrix c is m by p a times b is c equals c i j is m by p matrix where the coefficient r c i j is the sum of k equals 1 to n a i k times b k j equals a i1 b1 j plus and so on until a i n b n j so here we multiply the row a times the column j to have the coefficient c i j let's see let's see an example so here we have here uh, 2 by 3 matrix times 3 by by 4 matrix so here we get 2 by 4 matrix Here, for example, C24 is the multiplication of the row 2 of the first matrix, so here R2 of A, times the column 4 of of B. So here, A to 1 times b 1 4 plus a 2 2 times b 2 4 plus a 2 3 times b 3 4 so c 2 4 is the sum from k equals 1 to 3 a 2 k plus b k 4 so 
the key idea of the multiplication of two matrices is row times column with the same length here. So here we have a square matrix three by three times a column. So that gives us uh, one column and three rows. So here we have uh, three rows. One, two, three, and one column. So, so here we have uh, three uh, rows and one column. So here, the first row times the first column is A times one is A, plus B times one is B, plus, plus C. And here, the second row times the, the first column is D plus E plus F. And here, G plus H plus, plus K. So, this is a column vector. It belongs to R in the power of 3 times 1. So, 3 rows and one column. Now we have a 2 by 2 mat uh, matrix times 2 by 2 matrix. So here we get a 2 by 2 matrix. So here the first row times the first column 1 times 1 is 1 minus 1 plus 1 is 0. And here also zero. The second row times the first column. Now the first row times the second column here gives also zero. And here also zero. Is the null matrix is belongs to R two by by two. Now, the first row times the first column is 1 plus 1 is 2. Here also we have 2. Now, the first column times the second row, that gives minus 1 plus minus 1 is minus 2. And here also minus 2. So here, uh, this matrix A times B is 0, but here B times A is different of 0. So here, the uh, multiplication of matrices is not commutative. So A times B is different of B times A. This is B and this is A. Now let's summarize. An n row times n column if gives a scalar. So here, for example, uh, here x1, x2, x3 times y1 y2, y3 gives x1 times y1 plus x2 times y2 plus x3 times y3. So this is the big idea of the multiplication of matrices. Row times column with the same length n row, n row, uh, that's uh, row with n column, and n column is a column with n rows. If the first matrix has n column, so here the first matrix has three column, one, column one, column two, column three,
Then the second matrix has n rows. So here R1, R2, and R3. N, N, N columns and N rows. The multiplication of matrices is not commutative. You say uh, we have seen an example. A times B is in general different of B times A. This is in general. Thank you for watching and see you next lecture.